Okay. Hello, busy bees. I hope you are well. Uh, I would like you to start practicing writing your name at home. So I'm going to show you a few different ways that you can do that at home for me. The first one is you're going to have to ask mommy to write your name on the page and then you're going to take your finger and then just trace on the letters of your name for me. That's the one way or the first way you can start to practice writing your names. You can do that a few times. After you practiced with your finger, we can make a rainbow name. So once again, you're going to have your name on the paper and then you're going to have lots of different colors. And then you're going to start by making a rainbow name. You can use as many colors as you like. And you're going to go on all the letters with all the colors and make beautiful rainbow letters. I'm not going to do all the letters. I'm just going to do the one so you can see what it's going to look like. So you can do a rainbow name for me. The next one you can do is mommy can take your name and do the little dots. And you've got to take your pen and you've got to trace on the dots to make the letter. So what I'm going to do, can you see, I'm trying my best to stay on those dots to make the letters. And then you can carry on doing that with all of the letters of your name until you have spelt your name out. That's another way to practice writing your name. And then here's another one. You can have your name on top of the lines and then you're going to try and write your name inside these lines. So you're going to try and copy the letters as best as you can underneath it. Okay, another way is you can also trace your name. You can put a paper over and then you can see the name just showing through the paper and then you can trace over your name on the paper that's on the top. Oops. Right, and then another way you can practice your name, or even just the letters in your name, is by using some flower. So you're going to take your finger, you can keep your name so you can see the letters in your name. And let's start with the A, the A, for Albert. And then you can write it in the flower. And you can shake it again, and then you can do the O. And then you can carry on that way until you've done all the letters. Also, another way is you can use some Play-Doh and you can roll out the letters of your name if you like. I would really like for you to practice your name as much as you can while you're at home. Uh, have fun doing it and I'll see you in my next video. Thank you.